Hello and welcome to the Savvy Gadgets channel with me, Ian, otherwise known as Ven. And today we're going to be retrieving the Satori Katana, allegedly the best katana in the game, and the Konju handgun. Um, and these are the respective weapons of Saburo Arasaka and Yorinobu Arasaka. Now you can only get them whilst doing the Kompeki Plaza heist mission. So at this point, you've already got the uh, flathead from the uh, Maelstrom guys and you've talked to Evelyn, been through the BD role, and you've then talked to Dex and set it all up. So you're now arriving at the hotel in the Delamain cab. So before we continue, don't forget to check out our Facebook page where I post locations of varying items that I come across uh, regularly, like uh, iconic crafting specs and uh head over to patreon and support us there to keep my channel going so thank you very much for that so let's get on with this so you arrive outside Kompeki plaza in the delamain cab when delamain says shit's finally happening shit's finally happening apparently not almost forgot no iron huh? no irons you have to leave your weapons behind so it was jackie that said that not delamain all right harry let's go and so you get out of the car and you go to the top flat. So let's skip ahead to the point where we You're need coming? to be. Time's precious. Yeah, it is, Jackie. Let's get on with it. Okay, so you're at an important stage in the mission where Saburo Arasaka is now dead by the hands of his own son, Yorinobu. And you've grabbed the relic from the freezer Bug. and Bug is going to help now. you get out. First off, you can dive into Fuck. the bedroom and pick up the gun, the Konju gun. So you now have a weapon, which is handy. So this weapon is a rare iconic, can be upgraded to legendary, uh, does 188 DPS at the moment. Don't, don't know whether it's any good later on. I never used it myself as a gunslinger. I tended to use the Comrade's Hammer. Uh, see the uh, build guides for that so next we're going for the satori katana and we're getting to the important part of this you go up to this window t-bug opens it and then bites the farm right at this point stop do not go out of the door Turn around and head right up the stairs. Because what T Bug has done, she's also released this door, which previously was locked to you. Now, up here are a couple of guards, and depending on how you want to play it, depends on what you do next. You can either take them out with the gun, or you can actually sneak past them if that's what you want to do, and you don't need any particular skills in sneaking either. So just wait. Getting rid of those two guys is optional. Now what will happen is they'll split off and go to either end of the building. There they go. And we can go up here. And Now though the door isn't open, you can see the icon for the rare weapon there. If I stand up, there it is. You can actually take it through the door. So it's not a problem. So let's have a look at that. So the Satori Blade... Allegedly, although I cannot confirm or deny, it is the best katana in the game. I don't know. I am using it on my assassin build, which is blade heavy. When you know, it uses blades. Uh, so watch the live streams for that. Um, but it is a very good weapon, and it's the weapon that I use. I'm going to upgrade it. I'm going to compare it with some of the other big ones that I get. But watch that in a different video. So 287 DPS uh, can be upgraded to legendary, like I said. Uh, and it is a decent weapon, I have to say. But that's it. Thank you very much for watching. We have the Konju weapon, which belonged to Yorinobu Arasaka. And the Satori blade, which belonged to Saburo Arasaka. And you can only get these legitimately and properly through the mission heist. Or the heist mission in the Kompeki Plaza. Now, there are other videos which uh, use weapon glitches to scale the outside of the building 
or there is another one which allows you to sort of like glitch through the front door if you've missed these weapons from previously but I'll leave that to other videos so there we have it there we have the Konju gun a rare iconic belonging to Yorinobu Arasaka and the Satori blade belonging to Saburo Arasaka ah, they now belong to me or to you and that's the proper way to get them you don't have to use a weapon glitch to get up the side of the building after the event and you don't have to uh, try and glitch your way through the front door and then get up through the inside of the building when you're playing the game you can just get them without too much bother to be fair so thank you very much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe to my youtube channel head over to facebook where i post the locations of uh, rare iconic weapons and crafting specs and head over to Patreon and donate to my channel. Once again, thank you very much for watching. I hope you found this useful. Until the next one, bye-bye.